Ukrainian defense industry plans to expand its artillery production with new variants of the Bodena howitzer, one of the country's most widely produced systems since the start of Russia's full-scale invasion. According to journalist Marius Marzolkowski of Defense24, the Bodena manufacturer intends to mount the 155mm system on South Korean and German chassis, maybe track chassis, while also developing a version with a 39 caliber barrel. These steps would diversify the system's configurations and broaden deployment options for Ukraine's armed forces. The Bodena program has already reached substantial numbers. Marzolkowski reported that 345-wheeled versions of the howitzer have been produced across different chassis types, with an additional 100 towed guns completed. Current production is set at more than 30 units per month, with all manufacturing located inside Ukraine. The Bodena system has become a key element of Ukraine's counteroffensive firepower, providing NATO standard 155mm artillery for frontline units. By developing new variants on foreign platforms, Ukrainian engineers aim to improve mobility, survivability, and integration into NATO's logistics framework. Marzolkowski's reporting underlines that the expansion is not just about volume but also about adapting to operational needs. A 39 caliber barrel option could provide an alternative to the existing longer barrel systems, offering flexibility for different tactical environments. Meanwhile, partnerships with foreign chassis suppliers would ensure compatibility with a wider range of support vehicles already in service with Ukraine's partners. The program's pace reflects wartime urgency. With monthly production surpassing 30 units, Ukraine's domestic industry is maintaining an output level designed to replace losses at the front and sustain long-term operations. Locating production entirely within Ukraine also underscores Kyiv's determination to preserve defense independence despite Russian strikes on industrial facilities. If the plans move forward, the addition of foreign chassis and new barrel options could further integrate Ukraine's artillery into NATO standards while enhancing operational flexibility across the country's diverse battlefields.